Are you looking for a free and open source solution to manage all of your customers from coming from different channels in one place? Then this video is for you. Hi folks, this is Dan from Enterprise DevOps. Today we will be exploring an amazing open source alternative to Intercom and Zendex, Chatwood. So what is Chatwood? In this video, we will go and see what are the features of the Chatwood and how we can install it on our docker so chat food it's it gives you all the tools to manage all of your conversations crm everything regarding related to your customer so let's suppose you have the customers which are coming from whatsapp twitter emails website messenger instagram and you want to manage all of your customer related communication in one place then you have the right free and open source tool, Chatwood. It supports omni-channel. You can connect the boards here, chat boards also. You can have multiple teams, multiple agents which are working or assigned. So Chatwood, it will give you the capability of managing all of your customer related stuff, no matter from where they are coming. Let's go and deep dive to the functionalities of the chat board. Basically, if you want to automate your campaigns, release some updates, do some announcements, because you already have your customer data, you can use chat board to do the broadcasting also. Other than that, you can host chat board on any of your uh, desired platform like AWS, Docker, Heroku, Kubernetes. Other than that, you have the mobile application also, so that whenever some conversation is started, you can manage your conversations directly from your mobile application, then it's free and open source. If we will just explore the features, you will see you have a shared inbox, live chat, you can create multiple channels, you can set up automations, we will explore all of those features in detail. So let's just move deep dive into the documentation and try to install the chat board. For this tutorial, I am installing the chat board on Docker. You can deploy on any of the OS. We want to install chat board on the Docker. First of all, we need to make sure we have, we do have the Docker installation. So once we verified that we do have the Docker installation, what we can do, we just need to download these files. Make sure to add, update the Redis and Postgres password in your ENV file. Other than that, make sure to update the Postgres password in your Docker Compose also. So I already updated the password here in my ENV file and the Docker Compose file. And my Docker is running make sure your docker is running so the first thing what you need to do you need to run this command to prepare the initial database so we'll just go and run this command i have the portainer installed i will just drop the link for the portainer also it gives the graphical interface for your dockers what's running and everything if you want to check the logs execute in the containers you can do it from here uh, without using any command so we'll just waiting on the command once this command will be finished we will move with the next steps basically this command it will provision our db for the production for for our chat put. So our database is created now. Let's move to the next step. Next step is just we need to run our stack. Just come up here and run the stack. Once the stack is running, you can check all of your running containers here in the portainer. Just give it a couple of seconds. It will spin up your containers. If you will just see the logs. It's starting now and it start listing on this port. 
this is the rails port basically th this one is the chat put main application container this one is the side i key mean if you want to pass something parallels for basically mostly this container will be used for your cron jobs and these kind of stuff redis is for your cache and postgres it's using for the backend give it some time because the rail it will take time to provision the db so once it's ready you can just navigate to the port so this is your initial screen to set up chat food just write the basic information just filling out the information and then we need to set up the initial username password once you are done you are good to go so this is our chat food our chat food is installed now now we'll go and explore all the features and then we will connect this tool with our website i'll show you the process how you can connect with the apis with your twitter facebook instagram everywhere so this is our first screen where you will be seeing all of your conversation which will be coming from different inboxes then this is the contact list where all of your information for your clients will be saved mean their name company information and any additional note which you think might be so it will be there then after that you have reports basically it will show the progress of your company how how your agents are working are reacting to the conversations how much conversations have been done in the customer satisf satisfaction reports agent wide reports inbox team everything then you have the option for campaigns let's suppose if you have your data for the customers you can run the campaigns from here you can schedule the campaigns different campaigns you can schedule the campaigns and it will be delivered to all of your customers then on the setting section you have you can create multiple agents from here you can create multiple teams you can configure multiple inboxes you can assign different labels custom attributes and you have the automation also let's go to the automation so in the automation you can just write the role name and this is the event so whenever a conversation is created updated or a message is created you can configure the conditions from here and then use these actions let's suppose you want to assign to a team add a label send an email mute conversations snooze conversations send attachments send a message you can configure everything from here and you can create unlimited automation rules from here also you can configure can and response also let's suppose i will just create one uh, hello I'm just creating one canned response. This we will be using later on in this video when we'll create our inbox. You can create multiple integrations from here, webbox. If you want to connect with any external application, you can configure the integrations from here. By default, chat food comes with the dialog flow, but you can connect with the Rasa X or any other chat chat framework if you want. Then you have the account settings. You can configure multiple things for your account from here on the left down you you can configure your status also you have the profile settings keyboard settings everything here so let's go and try to create one new inbox inbox is basically it's a channel from where you want to receive your conversation let's suppose you can once you will go and create the inbox you can choose the option okay this inbox is for the websites for messenger twitter whatsapp email telegram anything and even you can connect with insta and all other stuff also so let's suppose i am creating channel for my website 
website name is enterprise devops website domain entdevops.com you can configure the widgets you can configure the welcome heading tagline you can enable disable some stuff here and once you can create the inbox you can assign the agents it can be automated also when you are creating multiple teams multiple agents you can assign them automatically also based on the configuration you have the automation here you can configure from here if you want to assign something automatically so let's suppose i have only one agent for the time being it's test we'll add the agents and this is my code which i need to put in my source code in wordpress in in a, a wherever you are building your website you can you just need to copy this one so for the demo i will just copy this in my local email once the website is open you can see here you have the chat option here if you will just open it you can see your company name everything your agents everything it will be coming up here so if you want to start a chat you started a chat give the team a way to reach you can these are some pre predefined responses it's coming from the board you can configure your own chat board let's suppose you will be using rasa x or board press will will go make some videos for that one also but you can configure your own chatbots from here so you can write any email if you will just come up to your uh, screen you will see the conversation here this is the con conversation it's assigned to this agent automatically and this time you can start chatting with your customer and you can see the response it's coming here without any delay you can communicate with the customer also you can edit the information for the customer here you can write private notes you can use the pre current response also and the good thing is that you don't need to be always on your desktop you can use the mobile applications also which you can download directly from from your play store so you can download the mobile applications apple or google whatever you are using and you can manage your conversations from there so right now the agents is assigned this inbox is for enterprise devops for the website you can create multiple inboxes from here and manage all of your conversation from one tool chatwood it's easy to use easy to configure you can use it with your websites you can use it with your instagram facebook marketing everywhere and second thing is if you just go to the contacts you can see there is full information for the contact here you can see what happening you can import you can create the new contacts you can set the custom attributes labels you will have the information for all of the conversation in the analytics path you can see how many open conversation agent status everything you can configure from here you can see you will have the you can download the reports also business hours everything you can configure from here so it's easy to use you don't need to be go for premium like zendex salesforce or any other tool just deploy chat for and manage all of your customers from one place no matter if they are coming from whatsapp twitter linkedin facebook from wherever it, it, they are coming you can configure the chat port link the inboxes if you want you can set up your chat ports here for example i can set up my dialog flow or rasa x or wordpress with this solution so it's easy to use just give it a try if you so if you have any questions any queries please let me know in comments i will try to respond as early as possible thank you very much
don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos mainly we will be focusing on the open source solutions the enterprise solutions thank you very much